Welcome to chemistry class. Today we are going to learn isomerism in haloalkanes and haloarenes. Okay, so haloalkanes show two types of isomerism, chain and position. Chain isomerism is the isomerism in which the haloalkanes containing four or more carbon atoms ex exhibit the chain isomerism in which the isomers differ in the chain of the carbon atoms and in the position isomerism the haloalkanes containing three or more carbon atoms exhibit position isomerism in which the isomers differ in the position of the halogen atom okay so we have two types of isomerism in haloalkanes one is the chain another one is the position in the chain isomerism there is a difference in the chain of the carbon atoms in the position isomerism there is difference in the position of the halogen atom we will understand more about the isomerism in the haloalkanes and haloarenes with the examples let us start with an example okay so in the chain isomerism we have difference in the chain of the carbon atom this means we can have the same number of carbon atoms like uh, in butane we have four carbon atoms okay so if we have a formula like c4 h nine br for this compound we have three isomers let us draw the isomers first isomer is c h 3 c h 2 c h 2 c h 2 b r okay so what is the name of this isomer 1 2 3 4 name is 1 bromo butane fine the second isomer is ch3 ch ch2 ch3 here you can see here in the earlier compound we have the simple chain of carbon atoms in the second one we have this methyl substituent here on the second carbon atom so but the number of carbon atoms are same that's c4 only you can see here one two three four here also we have one two three and four carbon atoms okay so the thing here is now the name of this compound is one bromo 2 methyl propane the third isomer for the same molecular formula is ch3 c ch3 ch3 you can see here we have 1, 2, 3 and 4 carbon atoms, 3, 3, 6, 3, 9 hydrogen atoms and we are halogen atoms. So, the name of this compound is 2-bromo-2-methyl-propane. Okay. So, you can see here we have three isomers of the same structural formula C4H9Br. Okay. So, this is the chain isomerism for haloalkanes. Now, we will understand about the position isomerism for the haloalkanes. Okay. So, in the position isomerism, what happens? There is a difference in the position of the halogen atom. This means the same bromine atom is going to be attached to different carbon atoms let us do some examples ch3 ch2 
CH two Br. Okay. Another one is CH three CH CH three. We can have the bromine atom here. So the name for this one is here one bromo propane. Here this is two bromo propane. Okay. So we have one, two, three, and here also one, two, three. So C three H is how much? Four plus is seven. So let's going C three H seven Br. This is the chemical formula, and for the same chemical formula, we have two different structures. Fine. So now we have understood about the chain isomerism and the position isomerism for haloalkanes. Now we will understand the isomerism in haloarenes. In haloarenes, we have only the position isomerism. This means in the benzene structure, the substituent halogen atom is going to be placed on different positions. Okay, so like this is your one two. This is your one three. This is your one four. Okay, you can see your one two three four five and six. These are the positions on the benzene ring, and here we have two chlorine atoms. So the name for this compound is one two dichloro benzene. This is one three dichlorobenzene. This one is one four dichlorobenzene. So we have three isomers for the dichlorobenzene. Okay. So today we have learnt about the isomerism in haloalkanes and haloarenes. To understand more about the topics in haloalkanes and haloarenes and more chemistry topics, just visit, like, share, and subscribe the chemistry class channel. Thank you.